Hey guys, it's TRT with a a Brick Arms value pack review with Ty Ace Dude. And we are going to do this really cool value pack right here. It has so much good stuff in it. Yes. Even a Star Wars. Star Wars E11. Oh my gosh. And a shotgun. Good stuff. So let's let's un box this all right so yeah we got the uh post publicity guy and then we have the military history person who's me so and also we have trump we got this cup that's not what trump looks like yeah it is <laughs> who gave that Build a wall. okay so first we I have this card okay yeah so yeah. this is the coolest coolest card it's the best card it's the huge card it's huge <laughs> okay okay this okay trump. thanks trump okay so, let's get to the unboxing. Let me move this camera. Come on. Okay. Let me just empty this over here. All right. First of all, let's do the shotgun. Okay. This is the coolest pump action shotgun. It's the coolest it's, uh, pump okay, okay. A action shotgun. It's a um, trench shotgun from World War One. It's a 12 gauge, focus. I believe. Focus. Now I understand everyone else's... Um, pain. Pain on YouTube. Yes. Okay, it's focused. Ripperoni for you guys. All right. This is a really cool pump action yes. shotgun. Yes, and not to mention, this is a GI Brick stuff, so big shout out to GI Brick for subscribing to us. Yeah, thank you so much, GI Brick. So, this is, this is a really cool shotgun. I recommend it for all you shotgun guys, because this is the coolest shotgun in there. Okay. Now Next let's weapon, let's see. Wait a second, first, let's give it to this zombie survivalist guy. His, his name is Jeff. For our upcoming video. Oh man, this is this is the coolest. This he is he just got one hundred percent thousand <laughs> zombie coolest kills. guy ever. He's so swag. Just look at him. Look at his face. He's like, yeah, I just got I just got the coolest thing ever. Okay, next we we're going to have the this E11, the E11, E11 Stormtrooper Storm. Blaster Rifle. It's really and, cool. Um, yep, it, uh, na it was a funny little tidbit. It was based on the British Sterling submachine gun. Here the we go. ILM just modified them, so they're super cool. It's an E11. Definitely can use that for Star Wars. Oh, yeah. This is the coolest thing. It's, mm -hmm. it's so detailed. Yes. This is amazing detail. Mm -hmm. Even has that great scope and the it's just this is one of my favorite guns yes next we are going okay. to have this um it's a giant um no it's actually a colt um 1853 navy pistol this is a really big pistol it looks great it's it's amazing for blowing up zombie head yes look yes, at this enormity of this this pistol it's so great it's so, so amazing right now. Bah! Okay, let's see. Just so you know, we might not know what all these guns are, because some of them are like sci-fi from video games and stuff, so just they be are. aware. Yeah, some of them. Um, okay, so, so next we're going to do this Halo gun. Okay. This is a Halo rifle used in Halo 3, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong, and wrong if I'm wrong in, in the, the comments. comments. This is a really cool rifle because I've seen this in a whole bunch of different videos. One of the coolest videos that I've seen. Battle of the Brick. Battle of the Brick. It yes. is so great. Built for combat. Battle yeah. of the Brick. Recommend it's like, but yes, yeah. I'm recommending that. They are so great. If you search up Lego Stop Motion, it's one of the first ones that come up. So just, yeah, if we get anything wrong, we're only in like middle school. So please correct us in the comments. Yep. So this is the most cool Halo gun ever. It's so matched. It matches everything. It's great. It's great. Look, here's Tr Trump looking all sad. Like, oh man, why didn't I get a gun? You know what? We're going to be nice to Trump. And we're going to give him... Oh, let's say. Let's say here. Ooh, this. 
Oh, and help me out here. What is this? This is a shotgun, it's right? A, um, it's a um, it's Winchester a 1873 rifle. Oh. Tubular magazine. My uncle has one. It's awesome. This is a really cool gun. It's brown. Yes. Also, Trump's going to have it. Okay. Trump, you get the awesome one. You get the Winchester oh, man. 73. Trump, Trump looks so happy. happy now that he has a Winchester. He's All like, right. oh, yeah, I'm going to blow your brains out. But sadly... This zombie survivalist is not a survivor, I mean a zombie, so Trump has no idea why he should kill him, and the zombie survivalist likes Trump, he's a Trump supporter. Rip Roni to that guy. Um, okay, I did not agree with what he just did. Oh, now, let's see, who else do we have? Come on, do you, I'm gonna do the, um, um, let's see. Okay, while he's looking. Jeffrey in, over here, say hi Jeffrey. Hey. <laughs> okay, so Jeffrey is the replacement, and next we're gonna do this I'm amazing totally gun. I'm not really sure what it is. It might be like a um no I, combat PDW. I yeah, think. it's a combat PDW, but with an extended clip. Yes. See that? Focus, focus. Come on. Okay. Correct us if I'm if we're wrong again. Well, this is a really cool gun. We I just really like it. It even has a bolt. Let's see if this guy looks swag with it. Oh my gosh, he yes. looks so much swag. You look he looks Jeffrey. as swag like as Kirby Stars. Okay. Kirby Stars is amazing. Thanks, Kirby Stars. If you don't know who he is, search him up on YouTube. He's a great YouTuber. All right, now I'm doing this one. Okay. Okay, nice. Guys, uh, now um, we have this chrome-plated uh, think 40 caliber... Machine gun, it's, look at the amazing glint of it. I think this was like the random holiday pick. It is very glinty. It's, oh um, man, you, you see that yeah, glint right now. I think now. it's like a limited edition chrome plated one. It's, it's cool. Yep, um, so next we have a, um, an amazing medieval sword. Chivalry, chivalry sword. This yes. is an amazing sword. That you sounded really dumb when you said that. I know. Yes, it's, it's just some a part of the it looks a bit like a. Let's um, see. Oh, do I have a chivalry chivalry guy? Fourteenth century Italian. Okay, while he's doing that, oh, I do. I'm gonna do this. Um, Heckler and Koch PSG one sniper rifle. And again, I'm don't think I got the name right on that. So correct us if, if me if I'm wrong. Uh, it is really cool. It's um gunmetal colored. It's, um, let's see how it looks with Trump. Awesome. He actually looks good with a gunmetal gun. Okay. Now you can do the, oh yeah, look, this is the awesome knight dude with the oh, sword. Oh yeah, so I found his chivalry chivalry knight with his <laughs> chivalry chivalry sword. You see, oh my gosh, he looks so serious. Oh man, this is amazing. I really like this sword. It's so detailed, and it it's really lifelike. Mm hmm. It, it is. It's it's more lifelike than the Lego swords. Okay, we yeah, got um, it is. a classic black bazooka. This is an amazing bazooka. I Everyone have like knows forty thousand of those. Yeah. Um. We all know what bazookas. This one's a bit more high quality than the other ones that are non-GI brick. See, looks great. <laughs> okay. Oh man, he just obliterated Trump. Uh, dude, why do you do that? Okay, now, um, okay, are you gonna do this one? Yeah. Yeah. We have no idea what this, this is. Um, I think it might be in, like, a, um, M23 or an M27. It's some sort of, it's like a submachine gun. I think it's from, like, Post Italy or something. Post in the comments, 125, and then think of your name for this gun. Uh, I, the name for this gun. It's, no, it's a name for this gun, because okay. people can make up their names. No. Can't. Yeah, okay. they can. Okay, it's, alright, uh, ignore what he just said. Okay, here's a Japanese, I think is a Titan. He looks cool. I think it's, uh, okay, that's cool. I think it's, this is a Japanese, uh, Titan 94, I think it is. It's, a uh, a, um. Mm, submachine gun. Yes, a submachine gun. It's, like, the only one the Japanese made during World War II. And it has a it's, removable clip. Yes, it's basically a Japanese copy of a, a Swiss Bergmann submachine gun. It's really cool. We, I have, I think we have one of those. Yeah, Alrighty, I, one. I got one for for Christmas in a World War II pack. It's so great. Yeah, we got these, and then... We have okay. a cricket bat. Yes, for whacking zombie heads off. This is an amazing <laughs> cricket bat. It could also be used as one of those Aztec clubs if you wanted to. 
Thanks to all the guys who play cricket, so GI Brit can invent this. This is the yeah. coolest thing ever. I haven't actually got the bat yet. Are British people out there? I don't know. Cricket is like an impossible enigma enigma for us Americans. So. Yeah, we don't even understand. So yeah, thanks I once heard for a cricket all those bat guys. On the, a cricket game on the radio. I couldn't understand. Okay, okay. okay. we have this this amazing gun. It it might be from like futuristic modern Call of Duty, modern warfare, or something like that. It kind of looks like a rail gun. Mm-hmm. This is another one of Actually, those guns. Actually, no. It might be like a, um, a Brick Arms... No, it's not. It's a... It might be like an M47 Tactical or M23 SOCOM. Um, okay. Well, anyway, this is a really cool gun. I don't really know if that's a um, a compressor or not. Suppressor? A suppressor? I don't a think compressor. that is. It mo a little more, it's more like a muzzle brake of some sort. Now, okay, let's Same see. Same thing. Okay. Else. Okay, we have this gunmetal colored... Thompson M1A1. I'm uh, sorry, Miles. Um, you didn't get do the review. Uh, it's um, it's it's one of my favorite guns yeah. ever. Mm -hmm. It's really cool. It has this. It's the stock is a bit miniature. People keep complaining to me about that, but you know what? I don't. Do I don't they? make it. Are you sure? Yeah, it's cool. I bring them to oh, school yeah. and they complain about me. Oh. So ripperonis to all those guys. Okay. Well, that pretty much sums up the video with Knightley here, and... I'm going to call him, like, let's see, what should I call him? I'm going to call him... Um, Knightley. Not Knightley, let's yes. see, what's the Knightley name? Knightley is David Lopez's son. This guy is named Knightley. That's He's, for you, Knightley. This guy's awesome, so are you. It's Captain Rex with a knight head. I mean, no, with a knight armor, because it's Captain Rex's head. It's I'm, Knightley. I'm going to call him... Augustus. Okay, that pretty much sums up our video. Thanks, guys, for watching. Uh, please subscribe, like, like and, and comment. comment. Please comment, because I think we got some of those guns wrong. Yeah, we did. Please do everything you want, anything you like. Uh, dislike, like, comment, don't comment, whatever you guys want. But thanks for watching, and see you next time. Bye. TRT out. And... Hi, dude. Out. See ya.